Praise the Lord. A lot of us need guidance right now. A lot of us are confused about what decisions to make, who to talk to. Good news, there's an answer for that. Now watch this. Proverbs chapter 3 and verse 5 says, Trust in the Lord with all thine heart. Number one, is God the first person you go to or is he the second? See, a lot of times we'll go to our mother and father and then someone will redirect us to God. God is, he's watching it. You know why? Because what we do is we give God 30% of our heart for us trusting him. And then we put 70% trust in those that have money, those that have been around the block a couple of times, those that are older than us. Understand this, the people that we're trusting in God created too. So I want to say this, is God your first resort or your last? Well, thank you, Jesus. Then it says, watch this, and lean not into thy own understanding. It does not matter what you know. It does not matter how much you know. God says, leaning on your own understanding will put you in a place. Y'all watch this, that you're worse off than you was before. Woo, thank you, Jesus. Now watch verse 6. It says, in all thy ways acknowledge him and he shall direct your path. That word acknowledge there means that I'm coming to God already knowing, watch this, knowing, not guessing, not hoping, but knowing that he knows the ins and the outs of what I'm bringing to him. And then the Bible says, watch this, now he will give me the spirit of direction. I don't have to hope. I don't have to try to guess. I don't have to beg. God said, when you put complete trust in me, because you know that I'm mighty, when you put complete trust in me, because you've been in my word and you know my credentials. See, a lot of us will not go buy a car from someone that we know nothing about. We'll find out their credentials, right? The Bible says, watch this, find out God's credentials. Look him up. See how he split the Red Sea. See how he delivered those from the lion's den. See how he delivered those out of the, the fiery furnace. Our God is a mighty God. Whoa, thank you, Jesus. So once I acknowledge him, then he gives me the spirit of direction. Love you and have a wonderful day.